Hi Libra, welcome to Karma Light Readings. I am Karma, and this is your Clear Love Weekly Reading for January 9th through January 16th for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We're going to be taking a look at the person that you are with or the person who is most on your mind. We're going to see how they feel about you, how they see you, um, Spirit's guidance for you in this uh, connection, and the probable outcome. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look here. Holy Spirit, what messages of clarity, enlightenment, inspiration, guidance, healing, and understanding do you have for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus regarding their person or the person that is most on their mind during the week of January 9th through the 16th? How does this person feel for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? January 9th through the 16th, 2020. How does this person feel for Libra? All right, Libra, what do we got? This person, okay, we have the moon. Could be dealing with the Pisces. We have the three of swords. And we have the knight of pentacles. Oh, this person is in their feels for you, Libra. They're really deep in their emotions going within. They're trying to... It's like an emotional battle between ego and emotions. What is real? What is not? They're trying to pick out illusions. You guys may have had a difficult past here um, or some really hard times, okay, where there was some deception or heartbreak, something that caused some pain um, or emotional vulnerability in this connection, Libra, where somebody doesn't know what the truth is anymore, but there's this glimmer of hope with the Knight of Pentacles. Like they do want to move forward with you in a stable environment, but they're doing it very slowly or they're not opening up and letting you know that that's how they feel. And, I, and this could just be out of fear. Like they're wishing that they could step out of the woods with you. But for now, Libra, they're really in their emotions about this, trying to make sense of what happened or why why everything is happening the way that it happened. Holy Spirit, how does this person see Libra? How do they see Libra? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. How does this person see Libra? January 9th to the 16th. Nine of Wands. Eight of Wands, Ace of Pentacles. They see you as somebody who, again, is stable. You have a lot of promise, okay, for a stable future. They, I feel like you're really anxious about the future with them as well because they see you as being very standoffish, not really giving them the messages that they want about this new beginning, I feel that you have been through a lot with this person. You're trying to protect yourself. That's what I see, Libra. It's like the messages, if you are communicating with this person, you know, you're being very cautious because although you have a history with this person and you're still holding on to something, I see that there's messages of, of stability or there's messages of a promising future, but they see they see you as just not sure. You're not sure about these messages. Maybe they've offered you messages of starting over and hey, it can be like this or whatever. And there's they're just seeing you as not really into it. You just you're not buying it right now, and you're more in this mode of protecting yourself. Okay. Holy Spirit. What guidance do you have for Libra when it comes to this situation and this person? What guidance do you have? What guidance do you have? What guidance? All right. Let's see what the guidance is here. Wow, we have the Libra card, Justice. Queen of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune. The guidance is to be patient. Continue to focus on yourself. Justice will be brought to this situation. 
spirit is saying it's really not for you to decide it's the universe has stepped in this is something that is faded some of these people could be dealing with a legal issue okay libra or you could be dealing with a legal issue but i feel like this is more about a time of self-care being nurturing to yourself getting up your money right um and that's why they feel like you're like no because <laughs> do you understand what i'm saying they feel like you're like no that's why they're seeing you as kind of hesitant about these messages of a new beginning. I feel, Libra, you're kind of in this energy of, I can do this on my own, okay? I feel like spirit is stepping in, saying, you know, just be patient, wait on divine timing. Things are moving forward in a positive direction for you, Libra. And I feel things aren't going to go well for this um person now i don't mean that in a bad way but what i mean is for some of you i'm getting a really yucky energy about this person or situation or what's been on your mind most okay um for some of you libras if this is legal issues has been on your mind most then this energy is strictly yours okay because this is what has been on your mind most there's emotional heartbreak concern something's not coming fast enough messages of everything being okay okay just know that if you're facing legal issues they're gonna go in your favor okay other than that for relationship wise balance is coming to whatever went wrong in this connection let's look at the outcome maybe they'll tell us what the that balance is what the justice is holy spirit what is the outcome of this situation january 9th through the third 16th why do i keep wanting to say the 13th january 9th through the 16th let me get those real quick forgive me can i have that one please hold on my daughter's helping me thank you all right so let's take a look here holy spirit what is the outcome for libra sun moon rising and venus pertaining to this situation or this person Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 9th through the 16th, 2020. All right, my Libras, let's see here. Six of Cups, wow. The World and the Eight of Cups with the Chariot on the bottom. So that's Cancer Energy. Again, wait for divine timing. I feel like... For some of you Libras, you know that this is somebody that you really care about, okay? You could be dealing with a Cancer or another Libra or Pisces, but you may have children with this person, but I also feel like a cycle is ending here, okay? You're, you don't need to make any hasty decisions. That's why the Spirit is telling you to be patient because something is going to be coming in very quickly, regarding this connection i feel like it's an end of a phase so that a new phase can begin because oddly enough with this eight of cups i'm not getting that that you guys are walking away i feel like you have to walk away temporarily to allow this new beginning to come in okay like there's a pause here there's a temporary pause in action and then when it starts to roll and when things start going better they're coming in and they're coming in quick because they are going to come after you or you're going to go after them in a good way. So I do feel like for some of you, this is a definite love connection. Okay. But there is some of you out here that is dealing with a legal issue with somebody as well. Because that's coming through very strong. All right. My beautiful Libras, I hope you all are doing well. Thank you so much. If you're interested in a personal reading, all the details are below. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.